Hi guys, today is a very important day for school graduates in Russia. Today people celebrate last bell day in Russian schools. The weather today for this day is just perfect, it's very sunny and warm. Right now I'm near my school that I'm graduating from and I'm going to speak a little bit about my life, my experience and about Russian education. This is how our typical school looks like. More graduates coming. They look so pretty. Beautiful flowers everywhere, a lot of greenery. There are flags of Primorsky Krai and Russia. Maybe we can go inside and here. Now there is security gate at the entrance, so I think only relatives of students can come inside. Here we have a wall of memory of one of the soldiers that died in the Chechen war. This part of the school is a canteen and indoor stadium. These girls are filming TikToks, maybe that they graduated middle school. It is very happy time for all graduates, but at the same time it's very stressful because final exams are coming soon. These girls are tearing their books or their notebooks. I was exactly the same as them. <laughs> they are wearing black clothes, like kind of this, some subculture. I was exactly the same with my friends. Like we were like bad guys in the school. What would happen in this day in the school is all final school graduates will gather in ceremony hall and they will have a celebration where they will cry and uh, teachers will speak their kind words to them. They will say something like, we're so proud for your hard work that you study so hard for many years and now it's adult life for you. So be strong, basically. It's all get started now and stuff like that. All boys would wear costumes they would wear formal clothes and girls would wear soviet style uniform with a brown or black color dress and an apron white apron i remember myself wearing this i was kind of very weird i had a short hair and a bank like that like a subculture and yeah, it was really cute wearing that. I really like this uniform. Overall, I remember myself in that days and I think it wasn't my happiest time in my life. My grades in high school were not good as well. I think because I didn't have any motivation there. I want to go to downtown now to see how people celebrate and show you more beautiful graduates if I can find them. I am in the city center right now and also I wanted to say that Today it's the rule that you cannot buy any alcohol in the shop. I just saw the sign and it says that alcohol beverages are prohibited to sell today. It is a big, big tradition for Russian school graduates to get drunk on this day. And you think they are not that smart to buy some alcohol before this day? There is such a cute wine shop here. And also they have a sign on their door that today they are not will be even open because they cannot sell anything. In Russia we have two big days for school graduates. One is happening today, it's called last bell. It happens before exams. And the second one, as every one of you guys have, I think, it's a prom where all final exams are done and you are getting your high school certificate. For official prom day, schools would rent different 
space for celebration. It would not happen in the school. It would happen in some concert hall or in a big restaurant because there should be enough space to have a big ceremony and then festive dinner for everyone, for teachers, for some parents and for graduates. And it can be a little expensive because of price of food and alcohol and printing and decoration and especially dresses for girls and also some graduates they rent fancy cars to arrive to this place i'm in the downtown now guys and i want to show you how our more fancy school can look like it is located in a good looking old building here we go and also of course a russian flag at the entrance it's called Gymnasium number one of Vladivostok. It is very central school, so only more privileged and more smart uh, students can study there. just got some iced coffee and I'm at Seaside Wall here in Vladivostok and it's full of school graduates. Just came here to the food court zone with my coffee and I want to share with you my fail story about my prom day. I had failed one of the school final exams and I had to wait for a schedule this exam to pass it again. So during my prom day, my results weren't ready. Other my classmates, they got their diploma, they were super happy and proud. They went to the stage, teachers congratulate them and I was complete failure. I didn't get my diploma on the stage in time, so I never went to the stage. So I felt uh, horrible. I felt like a failure that I will not achieve like anything in my life. I got past that exam and I got into the university later, so everything was not that bad as I saw. In university, by the way, I was a really nice student and I had only positive grades in my university diploma. Because I was surrounded with like-minded people, it was creative atmosphere that I like and I had more motivation to study to improve my future. What's my opinion in Russian education? I I think it definitely needs some improvement because of teachers as well. In simple Russian school, teachers would work for ages like for 20, for 30, for 40 years and the wages are quite low so i think it definitely need to be changed as i told you before russian typical school it's not a place with rainbow and unicorns i wasn't motivated at all when i was there i didn't know what i want to do in my life i didn't learn language as well but after graduation i decided to change myself i started to learn english i finished university i have lived in a few countries and here we go and now i'm here and able to share my videos with you guys Also, I was always confused how Western education system works. I know that you have primary, middle and high school and then you have college and then university. I was confused with those levels. If you can explain it to me, please write it in the comments. Because in Russia, it's pretty straightforward. We start our primary school at age of six or seven and then we graduate from school at age of 
16, 17 or 18. After that, we go directly to university. If you would like to have specialization in certain field but not higher education, you would go to college after grade 9 or after grade 11. Our university program is usually four years for a bachelor degree and after that it's master's degree for two years. This is how our Russian education system works. If you want to explain me about yours, you can write me down below in the comments. There is rescue operation training happening right now in the ocean. I saw firefighter ship who spray the water around. I hope it's just a training. Here on the ground we have special forces car and a lot of ambulances ready. А это учение? Это учение. А что вы тренируете? Ну да, уже потушили, я видела. I was right, they trained for the fire on the ship. I want to finish my vlog here with this nice view. I hope this video was interesting for you guys. And of course, thank you for staying until the end and see you in my next vlogs. Bye bye.